Ladies and gentlemen, today's date is May 11th, 2023. This is a Forex quick look. I'm going to take a look at the dollar versus yen. So sit tight. Looking at the hourly chart, uh, what uh, sticks out to me is uh, the sellers against the 200 hour moving average up here, here, here. You can even go back to here. We did see a break above it here. But the price uh, stayed within a swing area up here uh, and uh, on that break and uh, rotated back to the downside. So heavy sellers against the 200 hour moving average kept the lid on the pair. And in trading yesterday, we fell below the 100 hour moving average and also below this swing area, which was a nice little floor here earlier in the week. And I guess going back, well, I guess that's this week and, and going back to last Friday as well. Uh, it also was a level back here and here. Uh, and maybe right here as well. So, the, so this uh, this level right here was broken. Market rotated to the downside, and in trading in, in today in the Asian session, we moved down to test a low 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 from last week's uh, trading down at the 133.687 level, uh, and uh, found support buyers. That was a target, and indeed the price bounced off of that level. And what do we do? We went back above this uh, swing area, which was a bit concerning. But then we uh, ran into the 100-hour moving average, and what did sellers do? They leaned. They had their hands out. They were selling against that level. Uh, it was a, 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 a retracement back up into resistance, and when the price started to move back below this uh, swing area, we started to use that swing area now as resistance and rotated to the downside. That move to the downside did take the price below our low prices through here, which was uh, should have led to further downside momentum, but as you're seeing, we are seeing a rotation back to the upside. So there is a battle going on. We had a, the sellers had their opportunity to get below this swing area and push toward this uh, low right through right here from last week's trading 133.49. They couldn't do it. So we are seeing a rotation back to the upside, but we do still have the resistance against the swing area up here in the 100 hour moving average, which should cap the upside as well if the sellers are to keep the pressure on this pair and push to the downside. So a battle is uh, going on between support uh, support against this uh, 133.86 level, uh, 87 level, I should say, on the downside, and against the 100-hour moving average and swing area on the top side. Uh, we are trading in between those levels currently at 134.37. So, uh, you know, put on your boxing gloves uh, and uh, look for a fight uh, as uh, support buyers and resistance sellers square off. There you have it. A look at the dollar versus yen. My name is Greg McCloskey. Good fortune with your trading. Bye-bye now.